Hello, I'm David Inman, the Chief Revenue Officer here at Connected. And I'm excited to show you the platform that we've used to become one of the fastest growing companies in America and that tens of thousands of our customers have used to save time, simplify opportunity, and grow their businesses. Two things that you probably noticed right away. The first is that Dallin, in just a month's time, connected with 167 people and had almost 100 conversations. And these are with his ideal customer. And the second is that you have immediate access and visualization of your social selling index. That way you always know how healthy your profile is on LinkedIn. Now let's go ahead and look at how you might actually be able to use Connected in your sales process. Step one is finding your ideal audience. And we'll jump into LinkedIn to do that. Now don't worry too much about what I'm doing here because we teach all of our customers best practices for finding their audience here, including advanced techniques like how to use Boolean search. The important thing to know is that LinkedIn is by far the world's largest business network and that it's nearly unheard of not to be able to find your target audience here. After reviewing your search and making sure that these are the people that you're wanting to reach out to, we're going to take that search and transfer it over to Connected, where we're going to build your sequence. Now, before jumping into that, you'll notice that you can run multiple sequences at a time, reaching out to any audience that you want. Imagine what this could mean to your business. Not only being able to automate your outreach, but also being able to split test which approaches and which audiences you tend to perform best with. There are three types of sequences that you can set up. The first is in-mails, which even on the free version of LinkedIn, you have a certain number that you can use. The next is messaging sequences, which allows you to be able to reach out to your existing network. And then you have your invitation sequence, which is what we're about to jump into now, which is how you reach out to those in your second and third degree network. Setup is incredibly easy. First, pick whatever name is going to help you best organize your sequences. And then choose what time you want this sending out. This is great, especially if you're reaching out to different regions. You can make sure that it's appropriate times for wherever they live. And then this is where you drop your search URL from earlier. The nice part about this being a search instead of downloading the contacts is that as their jobs and locations change, this updates automatically over time. You'll also see that there's an option here to be able to upload a CSV file. That's useful if you're using tools like Zoom Info or other lead generation tools so that we can reach out using that information. The next part is where you get to actually set up your messaging. Now, this is personalized automation. So you're setting it to send in the background, but it is your words coming across. Don't worry too much about the templates that I'm using here because we help every one of our customers figure out the best messaging to use. You can even go one step further in your personalization by inserting tags that pull directly from LinkedIn to make it look like it was a one-on-one -on -one personally written message. And if you want to step up your game even more, we highly recommend inserting videos directly into these messages. Connected video makes this incredibly easy to do, and we'd be happy to help you get it set up. After you decide what the messages are, and then how much time is going to be between each message, then you pick out how long until it withdraws that connection request. This is something we require on every sequence because it protects your LinkedIn account so that you don't come across as spammy or impersonal. All you do now is choose how many invites you want the sequence sending out each day and click start. Now that you've identified your target audience and crafted a personalized messaging sequence, you're ready to integrate this into your sales process. There are two very simple ways of doing this. The first is the connected prospect tab where you have complete access to the names, emails, phone numbers, and other contact information for every person who is connected with you. Here, you're able to filter, tag, and leave notes to organize your prospecting efforts. The second way most people utilize Connected is by integrating us directly into their CRM. Here at Connected, we use HubSpot, but we support quite a few others with direct integrations. And even if we don't have an already built integration, you can use open APIs to integrate with nearly any other CRM. Not only are you effortlessly connecting with your ideal customers and sending them personalized follow-up messages, but now you're taking that data and using it for perfectly targeted emails, calls, texts, and any other prospecting method you prefer. We're not gonna dive into every feature of Connected right now, but you'll also have access to the block list where you can block specific companies or individuals from receiving your invites which is especially helpful if you're not wanting to reach out to competitors or maybe even that old high school relationship. You'll also have access to the ability to schedule LinkedIn posts, schedule one-on-one -on -one LinkedIn messages, create a proven messaging template library, 
and more that we just don't have time to dive into right now. Hopefully this helps frame the conversation that you're about to have with one of our connectors, where they're gonna be able to give you an in-depth view at how our technology works, as well as answer any questions that you might have. All right, that's all I've got for you today. Enjoy connecting, and I'm glad we get to work together to help you save time and simplify opportunity.